Hello? Secure the objectives. Is is there anyone out there? Whoa, whoa, whoa. Am I the only one that survived the apocalypse? Hello? 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 Anyone out there? Can you hear me? Did we all survive? Did we get hit by a meteorite? Did we get hit by solar flares? Did aliens come down? Did they? I don't know. Hello? What's up, you guys? That's here. Bringing back another video. We're playing some Black Ops 2 the day after the apocalypse. And let me tell you, I am still here. And unfortunately, everyone else is here. Including my ex, which is a shame. Because if the apocalypse came, and one person I wanted the apocalypse to take, or the Mayans, or Mayans, Mayans, is to take my ex. But unfortunately, she's still here, and I still gotta deal with her shit. So, basically, I'm saying is, what a crazy day we had yesterday. No joke. Besides... The stupid speculation of the world ending tomorrow, world ending yesterday, my fault, you know, and the whole, oh my god, you know, the Mayans, they gave us the D, they did give us the D, cause you know what, what suck, it must suck for those people who are out there who sold all this shit, and gave everything up because they thought the world was gonna end tomorrow, or yesterday, I keep, I keep thinking present tense, think present tense, destitute, but, that's crazy though. That's some legit craziness from you crazy people. Remember y'all? Remember Harold Camping, that old ass, you know, guy who said, yo, I decoded the Bible and the Bible said the world's gonna end on May 15th. How did that work out for you, bro? Not so well. Though I do believe in God, I do believe that the world will end in an untimely manner and we won't know. Okay, I get that. I'm, I'm, I'm cool with that, Jesus, you know. I'm cool with that. But besides that, when the mind's coming out saying, yo, the world is going to end, how y'all taking it, you know. Definitely just gave the whole world the D or those who gave up everything they had. So that's kind of kind of messed up. But besides the fact, yo, I actually had a really good day yesterday. No joke. You know, I saw a lot of... A lot of people making jokes about the apocalypse like there was no tomorrow. See what I did there? Besides that, it, it was a good day for me. Nothing went on, you know, nothing crazy, you know. Not, I, I didn't have to deal with no crazy people, basically, is what I mean. I wasn't expecting something bad to happen. I just wasn't expecting, you know, I was expecting crazy people to come out and say, Oh my God, you know, a pain on their face and shit, you know, no clothes on. If it was a chick, though, she had no clothes on. Okay, that's a whole different story. I'd be like, yeah, baby girl, the world's going to end. How about we spend the last 10 minutes in my room? No. Unfortunately, that's considered sexual harassment. I'll get in trouble for that. So, yeah, besides that. But I'm trying to think, like... What are some of the crazy theories that were going on with the whole Mayan calendar? One was Planet X. I don't know if you guys heard of this, but I thought this was crazy as fuck. But another planet was going to collide with Earth on May 21st? Like, yo, if that's going to happen, look out your window, put your eyes in the sky, and if you see a big old thing bigger than the size of the moon, then we got problems. But if you're going to say, okay, out of nowhere, a planet's going to come out of a wormhole and just fucking wreck the shit out of us, then that's some crazy shit going on, no joke. So, I don't know... I don't know what you guys think. Like, all right, I don't know where this big ass planet, bigger than Earth, is gonna hit us and just wreck the shit out of us. This isn't Call of Duty where shit comes out of nowhere and just attacks the shit out of you like random grenades. So, I'm sorry. Another one was solar flares. Even though it's the whole idea of solar flares can happen, you know, it just. I guess that was the main actual one I can actually truly believe. If there was such an event coming, probably be solar flares asteroids same thing you have to see them coming and the idea that okay nasa's hiding this shit from us come on you guys guys come on just takes common sense you know there's a lot of amateur um people who use telescopes you know amateur um whatever i don't know what the exact word but you know they do that stuff for fun you know compared to nasa they do that for their jobs or anyone who does any kind of any do with the you know the space universe you know they do that for a job you know we got amateur people do it for fun and I'm pretty sure if they saw anything like that they would have you know brought it up to the news or brought it up to anything so you guys I can't wait to hear one another world's gonna end thing because you know yo what can we say I, pr I survived the mind apocalypse which was an angry call from my ex-girlfriend and not gonna lie that was a pain in the ass but damn I wish she went no well, kind of, but yeah. Anyway, guys, I am playing some Black Ops 2 on Express, and I am using the MP7, and I am going ham. I believe I went 38-13. I only brought half of the game because you guys know how Domination games are. This is, like, really long. I got a Warhawk, too. Whoop, whoop. Um, domination games are actually really long. 
I don't, you know, I didn't want to show the whole thing because the whole game in general been 15 minutes, and I'm not going to sit here and bore you with 15 minutes of gameplay of domination. Ooh, that's kind of whack. So it's not my thing. So, you guys, I am ending it here, 140 to 23. It is straight domination on domination. Yeah. You guys have a great day. Thanks for watching. That's too. Please follow me at twitter.com slash that's chitty. You guys have a great day. Thanks for watching. This is that's too, and I'm shining out. Peace.